Hey everyone, Rome here. Today I'm playing some more Hearthstone Tavern Brawl. And today's brawl is All Star Squad. Pick one card, all your cards except like eight random ones are that card. I haven't tried it, but I can already foresee what cards are going to be really good here. I've seen a little bit from a one YouTuber. But other than that, well, I have one that I want to try first. This is one that I'm thinking might work really well, or it might not work at all, but... Oh, that one could work. Yeah. That's not the one I'm after, though. Ah, there it is. Mech Warper. I'm just like, you know what? Mech, war yeah, Mech Warper could work. Because, you know, a zero-cost mech warper and just throw out a bunch of zero-cost mech warpers whenever you get them. Although, against some different uh, deck combinations, it's not going to work well at all. But against some of them, it might work wonders. Maybe. <laughs> uh, oh, let's see what he's playing. Gomer. Hmm. Okay, Mech Warper, Mech Warper, Foot Steel. Nah, I want another Mech Warper. Uh, turn 2, I'm going to throw out the Mech Warper. It would be much better if I was turn 2, though. I was the second one. Uh, oh, well, you don't always get it as you want it. But that's just the way it goes. Another Mech Warper. But yeah, turn 2, I'll have to throw out the Mech Warper. And hope that he doesn't have what it takes to kill it immediately. If it does, I am screwed. Oh, he's playing a Mind Blast. Well, okay, yeah, I can see that working really well. But there's only one little problem about that. Uh, my, I can just use my heal. He can Mind Warp a bunch. But I'm going to be healing as well. Because I'm, I don't have anything to use my mana on. When you cast a spell... Oh, okay. First, mech, 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 heal. And push him in the face. So I got 10 damage on the board, and I am healing myself. He, he's, he can do 5 damage to me. I think I'm going to win this damage race. Maybe. Um, I'll need, what, 3 rounds to kill him? Yeah, I'll need 3 rounds to kill him. And he can't heal himself, because if he does, well, he'll lose something. Let's just throw him out, heal myself, attack, 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 attack. He'll be able to use two this turn, though. Taking me down to nine, I'll heal up to eleven. Then he'll be able to use two again. And if... I should, ah, I should be able to win this one. Unless if he has something else on his hand... That might uh, end me. Yeah, I think I, w I think I have won this. He has already used his coin, so. And the thing is, this isn't even one of the more powerful ones. There are many, a lot more powerful decks here. Yeah, uh, unless if he has something again, deal one damage for one mana, like uh, Holy Blast, I think it was. Unless if he got the uh, one mana two damage pre spell, I won this. Let's hope that he doesn't. But yeah, I can see this one being uh, very good against slow decks. You know, I can I can already think of a ton of decks that this would really easily counter. I'm not going to be using it though because yeah, I'm going to be doing other things. Yeah, I can see that countering uh, a lot of things really quickly, including the next one. I'm going to restore three health. Okay, uh, restoring three health is. Uh, Fine, but you're not going to survive. You know, your survival is not. Uh, yeah, yeah. He's just sitting there thinking really hard. How am I going to? Seriously, that's you not gonna help you. <laughs> okay, well played. <laughs> As I said, I just happened to counter that. There's so much things that thinking that what he went can counter. So many things. But let's try something else. Something that's a little bit, you know, a counter. <laughs> what about just taking one that uh, steals his cards? Uh, Holy Smite it was. Yeah, one mana, two damage. 
Let's see. Uh, actually, it would be better for him if he just to uh, take a deck with only a Holy Smites. You know, actually, it's just one less damage per two mana. But it can actually it could have actually killed my Mech Warpers. Uh, ooh, Twilight Whelps. Uh, for one mana, you just throw out a bunch of two trees. Yeah, let's try that one. That could actually work when I think about it. Just a whole bunch of two trees on the board. You know. No matter if you're turn one or turn two, you know, you're still gonna get two trees. You know, I was thinking of another one that's basically two trees as well, but as a combo. But the pro biggest problem about that one is that you need to actually throw out a one one first, so you actually do end up losing a lot. But with these guys, well, you'll always have a dragon on your hand because of the Twilight Whelps. Now that it does mean though you can't spend the last card on your hand or else you'll lose that battle cry okay now look at my dragons aren't they amazing oh my two three dra dragons i'm gonna fill the board with them of course he might have something really good that counters it of course but uh okay let's see what's your deck what's your deck uh, it is the babbling books. I mean, seriously, that's one of the more obvious ones. Uh, babbling books are really good. But you know what? Dragon, dragon, kill one of the books. But you know what? I have a bunch of two three dragons. You know, he has a bunch of spells though, so chances are he's going to win this one. You know, this doesn't scale upwards, you know. There are, for example, you can go with Murloc. You know, the one that gets one damage every Murloc you throw out. You know, you can get insane just by three or four turns. You know, this is not that. Oh, okay. Uh, what am I... Whatever am I going to do? I'm just gonna kill it. Then heal. And then throw this out. Okay, and go face. Yeah, I mean, seriously, just like, yeah, what do you think I was going to do there? Um, yeah, eh, he's probably going to win this. It depends on what spells he gets. Uh, he might get a bunch of useless spells. I doubt it. He might. If he does get just a bunch of useless spells, I might actually be able to win this. Oh, wow. Uh, okay. Uh, well played. Dude, I didn't have anything else than this. You didn't need to surrender on that. <laughs> Uh, oh, well, okay. Uh, actually, no, you know what? I'll, I'll do the... Let's just say, cowardly... Uh, uh, the cowardly tactic of just going... Uh, pal oh, wait. I got a skin recently, didn't I? Wait, let's check. My collection... Uh, how do you change skins? In here, maybe? Uh, ah, there we go. Make favorite. That means that... Yeah, my paladin has changed to that. Okay, f there we go. I got it for leveling up a character, new character to level 20. I was like, oh, okay. Well, I'm not gonna complain. <laughs> um, that could work, I guess. Um, bah. But yeah, I'm gonna do the tactic I was thinking about. Okay, it's not really a tactic I was thinking about. I saw someone else use the Murloc Tidecaller. Although, nah, you know what? This is way too obvious. This is what, like one of the ones that everyone will be abusing. Uh, you know what? Uh, no, I should do something else. I should do something else. <laughs> this one could be fun. You know, just, they're just for shits and giggles. <laughs> just a bunch of young priestesses. I mean, seriously, that... No, it's not gonna work that well. But it might actually kind of, in a strange way, work. You know, they're twos, and they're just going to keep on buffing each other up to infinity and beyond. My hammer burns with holy fire. My hammer burns with holy fire. <laughs> this could actually, I said, this could be a fun one. Although, turn one. Uh, oh, don't tell me it's, it's, don't tell me it's what I uh, thought earlier. It might be, so I'm just going to throw it out immediately. It, he might coin Mind Blast, right? 
If a coin mine lost, I'm just gonna surrender. Because this does not counter that. He coins mine lost because you're a... Oh, you're such a bore. Okay, and there we go. I'll do another one because... Uh, well, more precisely, I skipped the last one because it was, it was just a bore. It was another guy just going Mind Blast. The thing is, this deck doesn't counter Mind Blast at all, and Mind Blast is a boring one. I mean, seriously, the only reason you go Mind Blast is just to win. It's nothing else. You go Mind Blast just to win. It's not even fun. All you do is Mind Blast. It's at the very least. You know, the milling strategy, it's kind of fun. You know, because you do... Oh, I wonder if that will actually work here. You know, I'll try that next round. But yeah, at the very least, the milling, it's kind of fun. A little bit, at the very least. But Mind Blast is just... Okay, it's my turn, I cast Mind Blast. I cast Mind Blast. Uh, Mind Blast. Mind Blast. Instead of actually, you know, you're milling their deck down. It's not something you see every day. You know, just killing the enemy by, uh, with milling is unorthodox, to say the least. There we go, a loon! And now they're going to buff each other. That's why I'm just like, hmm, this might actually work. <laughs> now let's see what he plays, though. He might have something that perfectly counters this. To be honest. Oh, two armor. Well, okay. Let's see. A loon, a loon. <laughs> and then we just uh, attack the face a little bit. And then they start buffing each other. No. Oh, she didn't get one. That sucks. She might die. Oh, but, oh well. <laughs> Four health, two health, three health. Ah, oh, it's a mech warper. Well, that's an, an, that I can't uh, blame him from blame him from using that deck, seeing as I was using that deck just a, a few rounds ago myself. Oh well. Oh wow, he, he got kind of lucky with his card draw though. Come on, can I get something really lucky? Give your uh, give one one to your minions uh, with divine shield. Ah, dang it! I'll still use it just to kill one of them, and then I'll do like this. We kill this one, uh, then I'll just go face because I want them to buff each other up. You know, I don't want to lose this buff. Ah, uh, okay, that's good. Um, two of them are only one HP, that's fine. But two of them are going to be a little bit more difficult. Seriously? Are, are you retarded or something? Oh, well, I'm sorry. I'm sorry for saying that that it like that, but that was a really bad move. You could have stopped me, but instead you decided to go dumb. Uh, okay, fine with me, I'm just gonna, you know, mess with you a little bit then. Because that was a really stupid move. You could have killed my priestesses and made it so that I didn't have anything to do. But now three of them. You'll have to hit twice instead of killing two of them with one hit. Seriously, you're just going full face? What? You're an idiot. I mean, seriously, you could have done so much. But instead, you wasted it all and you did nothing. I'm gonna sacrifice one of them. Get it down. Should I sacrifice another one? You know, they're, they're fine on HP. Throw out this one. I'll get one of these out. Go face, go face. And then they start buffing each other up again. Again, he could have messed up my plans completely already. But he decided to not. Sure, I'll be down at 8 HP, but I have full board control now. And you won't be able to get your free mechs. Here's the biggest problem about doing something like that. It's just like, yeah. Poke. Poke. Uh, another priestess. I'll go for full ball control now. I'll lose a couple of priestesses because of it. Uh, 
But yeah, what's he what's he gonna do now? He has no board control. He has nothing to deal damage. Well, I have full board control and a bunch of shit to deal damage with. You know, unless if he gets a really good card. Exactly. Well, well played. I mean, what? It hurts my brain the way he played. Why didn't you kill the priestesses and lose nothing instead of letting me use them to buff up my other priestesses? Uh, I I don't know. I. But still, I shouldn't be. I shouldn't use the word like retarded. It's just like what? What? It just hurts my head. What? There, naturalize. This is going to only work against minion decks. And even so, a lot of minion decks it's not going to work against because it's not the right type of minion deck. If I go against the priest mind blast deck, it's going to not work. This is this is not a good deck er, normally. But it might be good. We will see. <laughs> Oh my god, I, 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 I do wonder if this is going to be good. Uh, I doubt it will. Who knows. I'll keep the wisps of the old gods, though. It might be good. Yeah, ooh, if he has just a bunch of things that makes it you know, basically free for him, he is going to win. If he has something that makes his other minions free, you know, like the mech warper... I am going to be losing this turn, uh, on this round, but um, if not, I'm, hmm, who knows, uh, it, it might be fun to see. Yeah, I, I don't know if this is actually going to work, I might want to save the coin for round 6, I can just throw out a bunch of, you know, one ones and just n uh, naturalize them, or just hit, the, hit them in the face, or you know what? In a proper naturalized fashion, I'm not going to hit him in the face ever. With anything. <laughs> if he hits my minions, that's something entirely different. But I am not going to hit him in the face. Let's see, what do you have? Paladin. Come on. Show us what you got. I want to know. I need to know. Oh my god, don't tell me you're just going to try to draw out the match as long as possible. Please tell me that you're actually just a slow ass or, and or, um, I don't know, making a cup of coffee or something. Instead of just being someone who wants to just rope every single round because uh, you just want to win. Because yeah, a lot of people will just concede now because, oh god, it's going to take forever. I'm just going to concede and go to another round. Yeah, it does seem like he's going to just try to rope me. Because I know he's there, you know, because he uh, showed it by moving his uh, cursor over his cards in the beginning. I'm not gonna go away. You know, this is, he's wasting his own time as much as he's wasting mine. But if it ends up this day just being a roping match, I am not going to be showing this because, yeah, just... Or did he actually go AFK? Did he seriously go just... Oh yeah, let's just go AF. Start the match, go AFK. I mean, seriously, what is <laughs> that? Just wastes everyone ta everyone's time. It's like, god damn it. Oh well, let's just open up this pack. Let's see what we get. Oh, golden rare. That's nice. So I got myself something good in here at the very least. You know, it's a fun tavern brawl. You, there are a few of them that does seem to be more. Just use this and win, but there are a bunch of them that are actually, you know, interesting. For example, one that I didn't use, you know, for example, Murloc. I didn't use that one. But, you know what? It's the most obvious one, and you probably all, you have all probably already seen it. Oh, I don't actually have the Forbidden Shaping. Uh, forbidden Shaping is actually very fun in this one because you'll always be able to use all your mana. Which is actually a very, so it's a very nice card, and you can still use it to just get a zero mana cost one. 
you know, you got a lot of really interesting ones you can play with here. You know, it, I do like top two better and top three. I like those better because you can actually do combinations. This one will run old really quick. Other than that, I think it's a really fun tavern roll. But, yeah. So thank you all for watching. I'll see you all next video.